Welcome back everybody, I'm Dragon Puppy, and today we are going through the Millionaires Club again. I got lots of good ones guys, I just play them as I got them, and yeah, it is as shameless as it looks. So let's go ahead, let's jump right into it. Alright guys, and first up, we've got bladders! That's right, and you guys, I just play these as I get them, and if you guys aren't familiar with the Millionaires Club, it's real easy, all you gotta do is go ahead and find a target that is a combined 1 million and then get it to me. There's lots of ways you can get it to me, links down below, there's a clan that's just completely open for anybody to come in, drop off a video. Alright, so what do we got going on here? <laughs> Don't worry about it. We're watching videos. <laughs> okay. So, you know what? Farming, and especially with Blatz. And Blatz has really kept himself kind of low and has been a very, very... How do we put this? Sculpted Town Hall 9, especially for wars. Uh, he's only upgraded certain things at certain times to get himself into... You know, to be able to draw better and... Now he's to that point where he's ready to start dropping that Town Hall 9 stuff because he's already got the good troops. And you know what? It's awesome having him in my clan. I'd never have to... You know, if there was ever somebody that you wanted in that number two slot, let me tell you what. It's it's one of the Blatz boys. And either, either one of them? Oh, my goodness. It just it makes it so much easier to know that they've got a really good uh, blah, a really good design going on on their base, and they know how to make their attacks. Oh, just look at this. We've got some hogs coming in from the side there. We got wizards. Oh my goodness. You know, one thing you guys really got to watch out for is uh, when you drop your wizards, you want to make sure that they're far enough behind that because they do walk faster that they don't catch up too much or pass your defensive ground troops so when you first deploy them it can be really critical if you just hold back just a little bit before going another thing just like that king rage always save that rage till the end especially with being able to build double troops all double armies having a full healthy king to go again awesome Anyways, great job, Bladders. That gives you your number five. And this one is going to give you your number six tick. I haven't gone up on the list, but it's still an awesome hit. And again, just think about this. I am playing these just as they came in. No interruption. You know, whoever was before him, nothing. Just, it was him and then him again. Like, how lucky is that? Oh, here we go. What's this again? Same style of an army. Keeping a couple of hogs in there with some minions for cleanup. But look at this. He gets the giants down. The giants are up there. They have their first target down, and now the wizards are starting to move in. You know? Really helps. Oh, bang. And... Hmm. You know, look at this. He keeps a bunch of troops back, too. He doesn't get too excited. That's another thing, too. If you can hold back some troops... Not the bulk of your army, but, you know, about 20% of it, until things have already kind of played out and happened, man, you are going to find that your attacks and your percentages go way up when farming or in war, if you're having a problem three-starring. Just holding back some things, waiting, for, you know, you might not have thought that, you know, this mortar and this Tesla and whatever was going to get taken out and there was just this little pocket left for you to be able to fill in and, and snipe. Oh, heals down. All we got left is poisons. King Rage is now gone. And again, critical, guys. Learn how to use your royals. Never pop right off the bat. If you can help it, you want to hold on for about half-life or really in that critical spot. You might even wait. It's like, oh, this building is going to go down before my king dies. I might hold on to it. And it really does work if you can hold off on those royal abilities until absolutely necessary. <laughs> I said, don't worry about it. Yeah, okay. It is as shameless as it looks, but whatever. Oh, 
you know, as soon as this wizard tower goes down, dang. Uh, yeah, there's the single point defense isn't going to be able to stand up to the remainder of these troops. Awesome, awesome, awesome attack. Clean it up. Clean it up. And... Oh, the giants didn't get a swing at that. Corners! You guys, if you watch any of my videos, I know this is just a farming. Just farming. But look at that. Do you see that list? That's all in a row. Like, it was a good farming day. In Australia, obviously. You guys ever find that? That all of a sudden you can do no wrong? It's just every time you click on something, it's just gold? I know Land Shark does. Great job. Great job, ladders. And that's, again, that's six ticks. That's so gross. And finally, that's right, we got NDB again getting a second tick. Oh, thank goodness it's not the one that got him into second place again. But, again, that must have been a great bloody farming weekend in Australia. I don't live in Australia. Oh, here we go. There we go. And, you know, sometimes it's just nice to take a little beefier army. Okay. Yeah, we got healers. I mean, and again, I, I am struggling with the healers, guys. I, I just... Oh, with the, see? And he's a big fan of these bowlers. I need to get them. I need to get the bowlers. That way I can give them to myself. And I can farm million. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> uh, hey, you know what? I haven't asked. I'm not going. I'm not going out there saying on my video like, "Hey, somebody could be giving me an amazing shout out." He's already given some smaller guys some shout outs. He's an awesome YouTuber, and I can't absolutely wait to be featured. Hoping and praying on every being to be able to be featured on his channel. I'm not saying that. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not saying anything, honestly. I haven't mentioned nothing. So don't worry about it. Oh, great cleanup. And, you know, these bowlers are just that overpowered. Get that healer. Get rid of those healers for him. As soon as... Oh, let a healer move smart for him. I have yet to have a healer even make it halfway through one of my raids. You guys think I'm joking, but I'm not. That was a wrong button in a big hurry. <laughs> and there's no chance of me re-recording this one. <laughs> uh, oh, boom! Hey, there's a little justice for me. Look at that. <sighs> big bombs. Unbelievable. He still has bowlers going. Lots of giants. And healers. He no, that's at least two. That's at least two. I don't know why they don't like me. Unreal. Anyways, great attack there, NDB. Way to get yourself a second tick on the list. And that is completely awesome. Anyways, guys, that's all there is for me today. So, you know what? Maybe you might want to go ahead and... Send someone a message. Um, uh, maybe... And if not, make sure to check out one of my videos on the side here, or go ahead, smash that subscribe button. If you've already done all of that, then please, please, please share. Let's get this out there. Anyways, guys, that's all there is for me. And I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to catch you on the next one.